Most construction sites in the USA are subject to the federal OSHA regulations found in 29 CFR 1926. However, if you're working on a U.S. Army Corps of Engineers construction site, your contract most likely requires you to also comply with their specialized safety and health rules, found in a document called EM385-1-1. If so, you must be aware that many of the EM385 rules are stricter than federal OSHA's, for example, Federal OSHA's general fall protection rules for construction require workers to be provided with an acceptable form of fall protection when working at heights of 6 feet or greater. However, OSHA applies a less restrictive threshold of 10 feet for fall protection when working on scaffolding. And for steel erectors, OSHA doesn't require fall protection until they're exposed to a fall of 15 feet, or in some cases 30 feet, for connectors. But under the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers EM385 rules, Fall protection is always required at 6 feet, regardless of where the employee is working. Here's another example. Federal OSHA's excavation standards require at least one ladder or other acceptable means of egress to be provided within 25 feet of employees working inside excavations that are 4 feet or deeper. But EM385 goes further. It requires a minimum of two means of egress for those same workers. There are also major differences in paperwork and training requirements between these two sets of standards. For instance, Federal OSHA does not require a written excavation and trenching plan, except in very limited cases. EM385, on the other hand, requires one for all excavations five feet or deeper. And while OSHA requires a competent person to conduct daily or more frequent inspections of excavations, they don't require those inspections to be documented. But the EM385 standards do, these are but a few examples of the differences between the federal OSHA construction standards and the often stricter rules in EM385 applicable at U.S. Army Corps of Engineers job sites. To learn more about construction site safety requirements under either set of standards, take our OSHA 30-hour construction training course or our 40-hour EM385 construction safety course. Both are available on our website. Train online at your convenience. It's fast and affordable. Check the first comment below for links to both courses.